What's up guys? Ben and Michael here with Fobofo Outdoors. Today we're bringing you part three of the duck blind build. So I've already made the trip to Lowe's. That is uh, a lot of money. I, people thought I was a millionaire at the checkout and I didn't even spend a lot of money. So Michael, what are you thinking brother? What, Man, what's the plan? I'm thinking you got some two fours. Yep. We're gonna cut them down and get the front wall measured out and stud it up then we're gonna start framing around it and up and then hopefully have enough to frame the top yeah that's it so we got a couple uh ranch hands with us i guess you'll call them we got sean playing the duck blind and then simon's back here i don't know what he's doing so we're gonna get to work man we got a little bit of daylight we got the breeze blowing now so it's half as high as it was earlier getting close it's so close we can almost taste it but guys Y'all stick with us, it's gonna be a good one. Lock it in. Heck yeah. Well, Simon found us a bolt, so we're gonna weld right over the head and that'll be a perfect little weld to keep that in place. You good? Yeah, go ahead, brother. Waiting on you. She may not be the prettiest, but it's a grain trailer. We don't care, it's a grain trailer. But hey, we're gonna get done with some stuff today. Oh, it's hot, it just got hot. So uh, yeah, we are gonna go get some, a drink of water real quick. And uh, Michael's gonna fix a couple of these little tacks, so. 
say I'd like this right here, 6'9", because I'm 6'1". So it's going to be taller than that. No, that's 6'1". That's yeah. So six six and a half foot. That'll that be your be nine. Be, you ain't about that. This is 48 inches. So Simon, you want to cut a six and a half foot? Because we're coming out, we can hang stuff down. Yeah. The back. Which, to be honest. Yeah, that worked out good. When I did this that, just a little bit. Yeah. What that I'll say it too, we can cut a little spot. I got, I got one. Can you give me that one? No, I bought one. Anyway, you know what I'm saying? Like that one is. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It wouldn't take anything, just that isolating tool to cut this floor out. Yeah. So we're taking bring this over. Taking all that angle iron out, we can use it to frame up shoot the shooting holes and all that. Yeah. But yeah. Hey, well, I think we may uh, cut some two by fours, brace it up, and then get some uh, get some of the plywood flooring down. So, what do you think, Michael? Pretty good progress so far, right? I think it's going well. We got a little bit of trig to figure out on our roof pitch and whatever, yep. but it's going. It's going pretty good. Absolutely. But hey, we're gonna get it done, and get it finished, and then we'll have the blind ready to paint and then drop off, and then that'll be. It'll be ready for duck season. We got the two by fours in the blind. We had the floor tacked in. Got a lot done today. It may not seem like it, but to us, that is a lot of work. Um, it was a lot of behind the scenes work, uh, measuring and cutting and, and the welding. You know, it, it took a little time, but we got it done. Oh yeah, absolutely. So we got it done. Uh, next video, I think we're gonna have it all painted. We're gonna paint it and cut some brush. It'll be, we'll be getting closer to dropping it. So instead of four parts, maybe a little bit longer, maybe shorter, we'll see. But we do have the exterior walls put in and the roof put in, but I think once we get all the cutting and framing done, that stuff's just gonna kind of fall into place and it's gonna work out good. So. Absolutely. But yeah, uh, that, that's gonna be it for us today. We're gonna hang out in the shop. We got the blind moved out. We'll kick back in some chairs, play some music, yeah. uh, you know, normal day and everyday things so if you like this video remember like 
subscribe, and hit the notification bell. Ring that stinking bell. If you don't hit the bell, you're not gonna find out what we're putting out. So hit that bell, and make sure you're tuned in to everything we're gonna play. Remember guys, always keep it in Fobafo. Lock it in.